Hey, welcome back everybody. Mark from Big Blue Designs here. And today I'm gonna to show you one of my favorite features that X has built right into their Cornerstone page builder. And that's the ability to hide different content based on the width of the screen that someone is viewing it on. For example, maybe you want to show a particular picture on the desktop version, but you wanna show a different one on the mobile. It's really easy using Cornerstone from ThemeCo. So let me show you an example of a site that has this going and then I'll show you how to build it for yourself. So here's a site I made for one of my friends last year and we specifically wanted to feature the different kinds of fences that he could build for his clients along with an FAQ section in case people had questions. Well we really liked the way that these round buttons looked on the desktop but normally when you have buttons like that and you shrink the page down to where it's mobile sized the circles got really huge and they looked kind of awkward. So I wanted to make a different set of buttons that would display on the mobile that might be a little more friendly for using your thumb to click on things. And so using X, I was able to make it change into buttons like this when you're on the mobile. And then when you went back to the desktop, it went back to the round buttons. It's actually quite easy to do with Cornerstone, so let me jump into showing you how to make that happen for yourself. All right, so here's the key to making all of this happen. I've already created different sections here for this site, starting with the header that I want to show on the desktop right here, and then the next section, I created a square image that I wanted to show when they went to the mobile, and then I also created desktop circles here, and then I added at the bottom the mobile buttons that I would like to show. And right now, at this point, the site shows all of these, which of course is a little awkward, but this is where you start. So the next thing you do is you go and you edit the visibility for each one of these sections. Here's how you do it. First, you click on the top one, the desktop header, and we'll click on the little magnifying glass here. And when we scroll down, we're going to click which one of these screen sizes we would like to hide this on. So in other words, I would like this particular header to show on all of the screen sizes except for the very small one. Okay, then we're going to do the same thing with the next one. We're going to click on this one and we're going to then, sorry, we're going to then go to that row and scroll down. And this one, we're going to hide it on every one except the small one. And of course you see right now we're on the large screen uh, visibility, so it already disappeared. Uh, let's go down to the next one. And these, this section, I would then like it to be hidden on everything except the small as well. And so now you already see what's happening here. Now to test this, you simply go down to this bottom row right here and click on this little phone icon and right from here, you can view what it's gonna look like on five different sizes just by clicking the next one. And watch what happens when we get to the mobile. There it is right here. All of a sudden, we've got this image here and then we've got the thumb sized ones right there. Then if you go back, you see the larger ones. It's just that easy and then click save and you are ready to go and you've got different things showing depending on the screen width.